So uh, this is from Elusive Panda. This channel only has 3.42K subscribers. Apparently they took the characters or the world of Final Fantasy X and imported them into Unreal Engine 5 to kind of give us an idea of what Final Fantasy X might look like in Unreal Engine 5. It's a short video, so I thought we could take a look at it. I just want to see what they were able to do with it. I don't know how good it'll look, but let's, uh, let's start it. Hey everybody, in this video I'm going to be showcasing some levels from Final Fantasy X that I redesigned in Unreal Engine 5. I'll be covering the software I used and my process for bringing these levels to life. With that being said, let's jump in. I'm going to be honest with you, it's been so long since I've played Final Fantasy X, and when I played it, it was uh, the international version and then it was upscaled to 4K and stuff. I'm kind of worried I'll have trouble telling the difference between what he has upscaled or what he imported into UE5 versus, you know, whatever the original, I don't know if he's comparing it to the original version of the game or the, you know, like the HD remaster they did. I'm not really sure. One of the most important things that would make the biggest difference, believe it or not, I don't know if you'll agree, is going to be the lighting. Like giving lighting improvements to Final Fantasy X would make it not look so flat on your screen. I think that that would probably be the most noticeable thing to me, would probably be lighting improvements. I found a couple of different forums that had various solutions for pulling the models from the game. One of- Bro, I'm not gonna lie, this looks so complicated. So a little bit about Ninja Ripper. It's a really cool tool that lets you pull entire levels from games with the click of a button. While this tool is very useful, it's far from plug and play. It took me about a week of using it to figure out the most efficient way to bring the models into Unreal Engine. That's crazy. Imagine being able to just click on and pick up entire levels and import them into another program or something. I'm probably not even completely comprehending like what he's saying, but it just sounds complicated as shit. The solution that worked best for me was to import the meshes into Blender, okay. export them as an OBJ file, Easy. then re-import that OBJ file back into Blender, and right. then export that file as an FBX. Right, you guys followed all that, right? Unreal Engine, and when these normals are flipped inside out, those portions of the mesh are basically invisible. But this is where Unreal Engine 5 is... Yeah, I'm totally following everything that he's saying. I used the Quixel materials for a lot of the models as they allow you to swap out some of the textures while still keeping the additional material data. Bro, could could you imagine if he did all this and then when he shows off everything, it looks like shit? Can you imagine? I would want to die. If I did all of this work and then all I had to show for it was something that looked like shit, it'd be so bad, bro. It'd be funny though. This model is from the PlayStation Holy 2 shit. version of the game and not the remastered version, but I still think it looks pretty good in Unreal Engine. Wow. So far, I've only redesigned the Besaid Village. Wow. The and a little bit of... Bro, what did I say about lighting? Look at the temple. So, without oh. further ado, here's my version of Final Fantasy X in Unreal Engine 5. Oh, shit. I take back everything I said. It looks like shit. Bro, it looks so good. Oh my God, I need this now. I should have never watched this video, y'all. Oh my God, look at that lighting. It's not perfect, like you can see flaws in it, but as a concept, just as a concept, I think this looks great. Man, what, oh God. See, every time, every time a development studio says remaster, this is what I picture in my head. And then I, I get my hopes up because I'm stupid. What comes out is not this at all, you know? And then, and then I'm sad, you know what I mean? But this is what I see in my head every time they say remaster. It's my fault, I do it to myself. They have to remake 10. Do you think that 10 was so good all it needs is a remaster? Or do you think 10 was so good it deserves a remake? Which camp are you in? I'm so curious. I wanna, I wanna see what the YouTube comments say about that. Who knows, man? Who knows, maybe after seven, apparently nine is getting a remake. And if that's true, we're expecting an announcement before the end of the year on nine, probably, right? But you gotta think 10 next, right? If they're remaking seven, they finish that trilogy, they're remaking nine, and apparently that's close to being done, we're close to an announcement, 10 has gotta be next, right? If we get something that looks anything like this, I'll be happy, I'll be happy. But I, I, I will just say again what I have said many times before. 10 wasn't perfect. There were definitely some flaws in, in the pacing of the game. There were some issues with, uh, you know, with combat and encounter rates that, that were frustrating. But the, the payoff at the end of that game was so good. You had 
brutal boss fights. You had character arcs that came full circle, multiple ones at the same time. And just such a, in my opinion, satisfying, bittersweet love story. The ending of Final Fantasy X is still, I think, my favorite ending to any Final Fantasy game I've played. It was just, it was shot so well. The music, the animation, the facial expressions, the dialogue, that final moment with Titus and his dad, when Yuna is at the end of the pier and she's whistling. So many brutal gut punches back to back to back on that ending, man. It absolutely wrecked me. Anyway, I don't mean to get carried away talking about the ending of Final Fantasy X for like 20, I could probably talk about that for like 30 minutes. This looked cool. I just wanted to show it to you guys. I think it's awesome. And it just gets me excited thinking about what we might get one day for uh, for for a real, for a real actual remake for this game, man. I, I hope maybe we do. But uh, it looks like nine is up next. The trilogy of seven's got to come to an end. And then maybe, who knows, maybe 10. We'll see. In order to get Titus into the game, I... Titus, you see, there it is. You guys can fight in the comments about it. You see what he said on screen? Well, I refuse to pronounce it as Titus. Now, there it is.